Hi! Welcome to the Physics Animated Series by EmilyLearning.com. In this series, we learn a physics concept through animations. In this video, let's talk about the difference between distance and displacement. If you like the video, do subscribe to our channel and like this video. This is Sam, and this is John. John needed to walk off for a while. Sam called John to ask where he was. Which do you think tells Sam exactly where John is? Scenario 1. John says, I've walked a distance of 100 meters from the market. Scenario 2. John says, I've walked 100 meters north from the market. In Scenario 1, John said that he walked 100 meters from the market. Since John traveled 100 meters from the market, he could move eastwards by 100 meters, northwards by 100 meters, or move back and fro in any direction, as long as the total length moved is 100 meters. In scenario 1, it is hard for Sam to know exactly where John is. Next, let's look at scenario 2. John says he walked 100 meters north of the market. In this scenario, we know that John travels 100 meters north of the market. So we know exactly where he went. This is called displacement where we know the distance and direction from a reference point, which is the market in this case. Let's summarize what we have learned. Distance does not have direction. Only magnitude. It's the total length traveled. Displacement has both direction and magnitude. It's the distance from a reference point.